Icon Sports proudly presents the Re Re Decision with LeBron James. Hello and welcome. I'm Ralphie from High on Sports, and I'm joined here today by Mr. LeBron James, who, after losing in the NBA Finals to the Dallas Mavericks, has announced he's going to make a redecision on the next phase of his career. Thank you so much for joining us, Mr. James. Glad to be here. All right, now I'm going to start things off uh, with an obvious question. Okay. Do you regret joining forces with Dwayne Wade and Chris Bosh? Hell yeah. I mean, they have no precision, no shooting. I mean, I'm doing everything out there, and they just don't want to do nothing. So, you know, it, it's just ridiculous. I, we should have won that. We really should have won that. Interesting. Do you regret what you did to Cleveland with your original decision? What to Cleveland? I didn't do nothing wrong. I'm just a guy that's just wanted to take his talents down south. I mean, you want to stay out in the cold, I want to be hot. Well, Cavaliers owner Dan Gilbert has obviously been very vocal about how he felt about everything. And the media tends to, to show us how things are and make it look like some sort of bloodbath and everything. Mm -hmm. What's your actual relationship with Dan Gilbert like? There is no relationship. I mean, we're not buddies, we're not pals, and we're, we're not friends. Well, uh, uh, in that argument particularly, people want to paint you out to be the bad guy, the, the villain, if you will. Do you feel like you're a villain? I feel like I'm an anti-villain. I mean, I really feel that everybody hates me, but it's just because they love me. All right, now, uh, before we finish up talking about the original decision, a lot of people believed a certain event occurred that, that caused you to leave Cleveland. Mm -hmm. I'm going to ask you point blank about it. Did Delonte West have sex with your mother? Uh, no, no, he didn't have sex with my mother. I mean, who, who would even think of something? Hold on one sec. Uh, this is Delonte right here. I mean, oh, oh, go ahead. Hey, Dad. No, no, I'm doing an interview right now. So, uh, yeah, let me call you back. Uh, okay, I'll meet you and Mom there. All right, bye, uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, we're just good friends. Okay. Now about you losing the NBA Finals to, to Dirk Nowitzki and the Mavericks, a lot of your critics say you shrunk or collapsed in the fourth quarter. What, what can you say about that? I mean, me, I'm a two-way player. I'm offense and defense. So I've been trying to do defense so much, and Dwayne Wade was hot. I thought he had it. He's supposed to be the star of that team. So if anybody needs to blame anybody, Blame him. Okay. Now, you say, though, a lot that the two-way player, you, you play defense as well. But what do you have to say about the fact that the game last night, while you were on the court, your plus-minus was negative 24? Uh -huh. I don't even know what that means. Interesting. Interesting. Now, I'm going to ask you point blank here. Will you ever win a ring? Uh, yeah. I, I believe I'm going to win a ring. I mean, I hope I get a ring. I wish I get a ring. So, yeah. All right, well, now this is what we've been building up to here the whole evening. It's time for your re-decision. So I'm going to turn the floor over to you and let you announce what comes next for LeBron James. As much as I love Miami and much love they gave me, I'm going to have to take my talents to the Lake County Captains. The Lake County Captains, really? Yes. A minor, minor league baseball team. Yes. Just yes. like um, Michael Jordan before you. Exactly. It's very interesting. Very not interesting. Michael Jordan. Oh, what's I'm that? Oh, excuse I'm me, one moment. I've uh, just been handed a, a, a bulletin here. Apparently, Pat Riley, president of the Miami Heat, mm -hmm. has written an open letter to the fans, and he's chosen to use all caps and comic sans. He says, I am outraged by LeBron leaving the Miami Heat. He will soon learn that you have to go through hell to get to heaven. He will take a curse with him wherever he goes. And now uh, at the end here, he makes a very bold statement. I personally guarantee the Miami Heat will win an NBA championship before the Lake County captains. <laughs> <laughs> no. It will never happen. Never. <laughs> I believe Lake County captains have a very good team, and I think I have a, enough talent in there to make sure I get a championship. But Miami? <laughs> no. It's very interesting. Thank you very much, Mr. Project. Thank you.